Hello everybody, Toasted Baby here, and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas with mods. Uh I'm oh. sneaking up behind the gecko, right? The game just kind of stuttered there. Hold on. Okay. Uh well Willow Peter Pants. Um yeah, so you guys overwhelmingly want me to start Old World Blues. And uh, you, you you're quite rude about it too. I don't I, I don't know. I don't know if I raised you guys wrong, but anyway, uh yes, yeah, so we're gonna start Old World Blues. Uh, I got some ammo for the cryo revolver. Let's see if it works. Works very well. Ooh, look at that. That's cool. So yeah, it works. Um, also, I was playing around in the Gek. I was trying to modify Typo to make him even more useless. Um, I tried to modify his follow distance so he's not sniffing our ass hairs all the time, but I couldn't find the uh, follow multiplier. I think it's at 100 by default, but I kind of want to make it like 800. So he followed about that far away. I uh, don't really want to follow more ass hairs, but I did, uh, was playing around, and I think I discovered how to do dialogue. So I'm going to try and do some dialogue for Typo, and then he's just going to bark like a dog whenever we want to talk to him. So, uh, probably going to end up editing Typo. Didn't kind of ran out of time today, but, uh, because it's already 3 a.m., so, you know. Um, but, uh, yeah, so there's, going to edit Typo, uh, that should be, let's go ahead and start Old World. Oh, wait, no, we have to wait till midnight. Nine, oh, wow, that's gonna be a while let's do this god we have to wait forever and you're allowed to take um all the items you want with you to old world blues you just can't come back until you complete the main missions and blah blah, blah. Ah, there we go ready to go typo i know you are Woohoo! take a closer look i hope number you know what? I think number five is going to fuck up this video. He always does. Oh, there goes Veronica. And we lost. Oh, enhanced sensors. I love that perk. Well, I think uh, number five is going to fuck up the cutscene for us because he always does. Woo! Thank you for that fruit punch. Wait, wait. Oh, number five's not crawling in the screen. Oh, number five, you're finally learning. In the years before the Great War, <laughs> Big Mountain had been the home to the kidding. brightest mind Let's listen. the 21st century. You guys don't like when I talk during cutscenes, so I'm not going to talk during cutscenes, because for some reason you guys don't... I'm just the kidding. Facility ...to tackle the greatest technological challenges of the era. They sought to create a new world, fueled by technology for the benefit of all mankind. Sonic emitters, space-age alloys, DNA hybridization, force-field particle research, autodoc advances in cranial, cardiac, and trauma surgery. The hopes and dreams of a century became realities in the electronic forges of Big Mountain. The nucleus of this research was the dome. A huge stone facility that held the labs of every science known to man. It was a think tank where no problem could not be solved, where no question could not be answered. The Great War brought a new energy to Big Mountain and its scientists. Although sheltered from the front lines, the scientists waged their own war fighting their battles at the atomic level. Equations and calculations marched endlessly across chalkboards and computer terminals toward one solution, winning the war. For years, the minds and computers of Big Mountain were a blaze of trajectories, weapon schematics, and nuclear theories. The problems began to outpace the solutions, first geometrically, then exponentially. As the war escalated, so did the questions. On the night of October 23rd, 2077, the scientists received an answer that put all their questions to rest. In the aftermath, Big Mountain's silent experiments went to sleep, their creators slowly dying in the new world that had been left behind. And the great stone in the middle of the Big Empty lay untouched, filled with 
countless technological wonders. Wonders that, in the end, had been answers to the wrong question. Bum, bum, bum. I think that's the first cutscene for a DLC that number five has not ruined for us, so it's already starting out pretty well. And this is one of, I think, uh, for as far as favorite DLCs go, I don't know if it's, I think it, it would have to be this one by a small margin over Lonesome Road. Because it's just, this one's just kind of funny because it's just a bunch of bickering between the scientists and a lot of penis jokes. So yeah. Uh, body reveals faint surgical scars around your head, chest, and back. Dun, dun, dun. Welcome to the Big Empty. Woo! Crow Revolver! Do we still have all of our guns? And there's our ass. Is there... Ew, we're wearing, like, weird underwear. Oh, no! We're wearing patient gown! Do we have our clothes? Yes, we do. So let's go ahead and put on the advanced recon armor, um, leather backpack, and oh, we already have all that stuff on. So we have that. Are our guns still mapped? Yes, they are. Oh, lovely, 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 lovely. Um, poo, poo, poo. Oh, and I finally got the teddy bear charges back from Willow. Apparently she had to like unequip them in her inventory or something weird like that. So here we go. Up there we go. We're going to the sink. Baby. We're here. Now, is this working? Ah, so basically, uh, this ha they, they're all the machines in here, not all the machines, most machines have like a personality that we need to find the disc for. And then they like talk to you and they interact and then they make stuff. Like we have um, toaster here. I think we, if we give it like uh, if we give the toaster toasters, it gives us microfusion cells. And then this, if we give it um, muggy, if we give it mugs, then it gives us stuff. So yeah, and then the light switch, the light light switch number two is jealous of light switch number one. They think that they're cheating on each other. So yep, this is it for this stuff. What are our quests? It's good that we already have all these markers. Welcome to the Big Empty. Find out where the hell you are. I'm right here. Whee! And Big Empty. Let's go ahead and just fix that. There we go. No, we just came from there. Let's get this out. And ooh, this condition's kind of going down. But we're going to the Think Tank. There we go. Strange feeling of pacifism comes over you. You find you cannot draw your weapon for some reason. Ah, I think it's the pacification shield. Do, do. Ah, there they are. It's the think tank. It's a bunch of robots. Oh, God damn it, number five. Pacification fields kick in. All right, shh. Nobody move. I'll handle this. Be warned, intruder. You are in the presence of a mighty think tank of Big Mountain. The collective geniuses of... We! Why, Oppenheimer, which one of you self-professed geniuses has been adjusting my volume knob? Who was it? Was it you, H? Oh, Dr. O, was it? Likely story. Oh, couldn't spark two neurons if they were in a lattice of biomed gel. What? Me? Breaking news, Klein. It wasn't me, all right? I'm the robotical engineer. A to sound waves. That's his specialty. You always do this. You always demean me in front of guests. And it's not O, all right? It's... Enough! Either of you yeah, there, by the way, there's a lot of dialogue at the beginning of this. I think it's about 15 to 20 minutes of dialogue. I don't think I'm going to go through all of it, and if I do, I'll just do the quick stuff, because, yeah. How are we all speaking through that one voice box? Did it just say something? Anyone catch that? Haha. It's a lobotomite! No! Oh, as if this situation couldn't get any worse. Now we've got lobotomite! Ha ha, lobotomite? Dr. Klein. If my hypothesis is correct, this lobotomite is the repository of the brain we sent the Skin envelope. If so, it's proof. Just look at it. The 
way it blinks. It's like a big, hairless teddy bear. Mm hmm I know what it is, Dollar. I want... I believe those are toes, Dr. Klein. Little teddy bear toes. Penises are much larger than those tiny extremities. Yeah, not that I would know. See? Already starting the penis, penis jokes. Being that large. It depends <laughs> on one's own frame of reference, Dr. O. Look at its little nose with its two orifices for ingesting oxygen. Noses? By the great static. These lobotomites confound me with their sheer number of useless extremities. But those guys used to be human too. No, it's holding up an array of fully erect hand penises. If it tries to insert them, activate vivisectors. Haha. <laughs> Dr. Clyde. Wait. I... I don't believe those gestures were random. Random at all. It's been following our conversation. The lobotomite understands us. Bam, bam, bam. I agree with Boros's histrionic findings. This little lobot... Nonsense. Lobotomites can't come. Mm -hmm. Ace, have you been in the men's hats again? If we slow down our oral process... All of you, power down, shut up, and let me prove... Lobotom... Uh-huh. See, Those look at all this dialogue, and just keeps on going. In the form of questions. He's asking me questions. Our efforts have turned against... Ah, they created a monster. Perhaps we were ruthlessly lobotomizing it with our cutters, we filled the skin below... Wait. If what you're theorizing is... Then this may be... Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Dr. Klein, I'll try... It... Dun dun dun! My old colleagues, the mighty think tank of Big Mountain. Big fools! Oh, it is I, Dr. Mobius, transmitting from my dome-shaped dome in the Forbidden Zone, a zone that is, yes, forbidden to you! Oh ho! They can't get there. They get along so Even well. the technology sealed in the big mountain research centers cannot save you. So, that's all. Uh, goodbye. Mobius. Always the God, same. God, number five, broadcast. really? He's We're having a nice conversation. Insane by his flawed and imprecise kindergarten level research methodology. What are we going to do? There's no way we can breach the Forbidden Zone. There's this robot. The Forbidden Zone. Mm -hmm. Except Dr. Mobius and the technologies that could save us. They. And Dr. Mobius mocks us. Did you see his cracked monitor? He's clearly let himself go. What? Ask the lobotomite for help? If this lobotomite responded, Dr. Klein, then it is clearly intelligent. But what of its brain? We scooped that out. We don't even know where we left it. And for putting it back in, none... Yes, but it's still aware and responsive. Look at it. It's regard... If we ask it politely, and leave the part about the unnecessary, ruthless lobo... You removed my brain? We removed your brain. Yes. So soft, barely wrinkled. That's not very brain nice. Extraction technology has been standard... Once the brain was out, then came... Your brain has been replaced with advanced technologies. Your head can no longer be crippled and resistant to chem addiction. And shock from bodily damage. Ooh, plus 5% DT. Minimum of plus 1. Perfect. Yeah, Abe, no need to brag. Wherever your brain is, it's transmitting thoughts to you. The Tesla... So I have Tesla coils in my head. In many respects. If your brain was anywhere in the dome, why, you could... Circumventing the pacification field. This is a no-no. We have never been in a fight. We do not want that. Reminds me of my days in American High. And Richie Marcus. 
doesn't explain the laser sutures on my chest and on my spine. Darla, was it necessary this time? I assume full responsibility. I take Reading 94 experience for each one of those? Wow. Living, breathing tissue quite seriously. Wow. Although in truth, the once it had removed the brain and I misplaced it, other organs began to cry for joy. Rather than let them send their signals, I removed them as well. First. So she took my heart and my spine. The scars in your chest seem to confirm what the think tank is saying. You cannot be poisoned, and filters in your artificial blood pump will regulate bleeding and healing, allowing all healing items, chems, to refunction at a higher level, plus 25%. Robots are not confused by you, and 50% less likely to score a critical hit. Fantastisch. Oh, wait, I mean, second was the heart. Brain was first. Due to complications with the procedure, your spine has been replaced as well. Your torso can no longer be crippled, and your strength and damage threshold have been, been increased by plus one. Fantastic. Spine. Totally. Look at me with my lumbar and... Took my brain, heart, and spine. That auto-dock junk heap was one of Mobius. After that, the brain lost itself. Not in the metaphysical sense. Might have gotten flushed into one of the pipes. Actually... If so, it was flushed all the way to Mobius. Flush. That is the sound of flushing. It is the sound of flushing, Dr. Right, Klein. Yes, it is. Orlando there we go. Bottomite. In most probable of probabilities, our enemy, Mobius, has your brain. This is not good. He will most likely come after our brains next. Oh, no! We want... Uh, with science, stop him with science. Yes. That's the plan that came after chance, Mobius's first broadcast. Maybe, just maybe. So I am recovering lost technologies, technologies because these guys are too fucking Mobius moronic to do it themselves. What exactly is the plan? You're losing me in the generality as I need specifics. The plan was very complicated. We are still calculating how. Hey, why me? Can't you do it? Um, no. 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 Why not? You are equipped. It's kind of embarrassing. You have hands, and, uh, a heartbeat, sort of, and eyes, mostly the Enough! Uh, what do you need me to do? Excellent. This is turning out much better than the activate the retreat protocols and cower in my room idea I had earlier. Ha-ha! Agreed. Oh, and I've used my robotical knowledge to, um, uh, trans... Settle down, Eight. I would have gotten it in a second, all right? Eight transmitted the last known coordinates of the research center. They, well, move sometimes, or get buried, or blow up. Ha! <laughs> yes, they do. Eight is correct. Uh, schematics. Okay, so. so... Not give in to your... And even if you die in the act of reclamation, yay! Leveled up. Reaching them will auto transmit. Uh, so this place seemes dangerous. These devices sound dangerous. Nonsense. And this is where we get all the uh, X places no where we go to the different research centers. Detonation site. Our technology is no more lethal than an overcharged Tesla cannon. Ho ho! The technologies are the X2 transmitter antenna array used to focus coherent. Mm -hmm. The psychoanalytic cardiac dampening sneaky stealth suit. A suit like nothing. This and, and sound wave gun, there. so those are what we need to get. If you were. Um, the faster I can get through this, the better. Our intentions exactly. Do not get curious, or you will end up. We fear you Schrodinger's cat. I'm neither a dead nor alive to confirm either way. Any amazing non-mandatory research labs that lie off your designated path. The many such optional explorations are discouraged. Work hurriedly, as if you have. Right, you are, right? Yep, no, yeah, how quickly you ran our maze. Sword. There we go. All, Guess I better get walking then. Pylons? What pylons? Fence that surrounds the mighty radar. If you get near it, your vision will blur as the electrodes in your head shot. Possible memory loss, but the no So you go to the pylons, you die. Inconveniences are less than the you there we go, so I can't leave. Oh, uh, Dr. What is it? Well, you know how we asked it to f What is this, a high school science fair? You're always yelling, my res- Uh, if you have the gun already, I don't understand this what you need. This is truly the end of all intelligence when the- Oh, uh, let's go ahead and skip through this. Lost, they lost it, uh, getting stuff. 
So much dialogue. I think he's sunjaculating into the gun. Getting it warmed up. Ew, he's sunjaculating. <sighs> Ding. Turkey's done. Ooh. You give it to the lobotomy. Oh. I'll do it if you two are going. There we yeah. go. Uh, energy cells have a high expenditure rate. What did it say? Oh, a gun? Are you mad? We can't give it a... Dr. Eight is correct. We already have given the teddy bear a lethal sonic death ray. Filled with his sonic ejaculate and sterilized by my soft... Wing. That's so the awkward. The teddy bear gun would be the equivalent of following a glass of hemlock with an Abraxo chaser. Delicious and redundantly deadly. If you're going to... Mm -hmm. Are you... Wait, I said that already. Yes, I have the Cyberdog gun. With... Fine. There we go. Ooh, we got the Cyberdog gun already. Um, this gun looks really hungry. I'd like to make sure... There we go. And... Hollow points. And then this... There we go. Nice just should be enough. Force fields prevent us from the, the sonic emitter was specially designed to disable our own. Okay, wait, so this gun he gave me can disable force fields. Yeah. Well yeah, we lost that. Uh I care less. Can I go? There we go. Alright. Uh do 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 lot of stuff. Then make whatever crude biologic demands you need of the sink. It will Uh I can trade with the sink intelligence, I'll need something to activate the function, won't I? Oh my god, so much so much dialogue. There we go. There we go. Bottle uh There we go. Fixing things, mass produced. Are there other Are chips? There. there we go. Yeah. There we go. So we leveled up. Uh, what do we want? We wanted unarmed up to 50, so we can train Willow. And then. Sneak up one. Okay. Oh, now I have to pick another perk. Damn it. Uh. My my fry. Ah, uh, why not? We'll just do that. I don't really care about the other perks. Okay, now the one that I wanted to talk to was that chick one because she she makes like random broadcasts over the audio, like the. PA system about our penis feet. There we go. You are an unusual specimen to so boldly walk between the extraction of their higher reasoning abilities and urination inducing fear. Most lobotomites dare not approach us. Mm hmm. The quick scribe jumped over the lazy paladin. Yes, yes. Go on. Seeing your. How does it feel to have the flesh roll? Like having a fish or extremely dexterous slug. Fascination. What? Stop it. Ah, that is fun. Enough. I'm. I don't know what it is about the biology of. I got her wet. It. It. Ha! Huh, here we go. Perhaps. Perhaps there is. Would you? I feel so ashamed, but yet so intrigued. If you're ready, let me radar scan you. Slowly. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is a robot orgasm. <laughs> Thank you. 
Uh, that was Please, awkward. You must come back for further study when I've had a rest. I'm a little sensitive right now. Mm. Uh. Until our next. Uh, so I got her wet. So yeah, we can talk to all these people. I'll probably end up doing that off camera just to get extra quests from them. Because there is a lot of dialogue. Let's see. Ooh, scientist glove. Sweet. And then let's see. Wait. But can I not run anymore? I still have... I should still be able to run. Let's see. Hmm. What's in here? Footlocker. Bottom mic. Goggles? Why not? I guess I can't run with the uh, field down. What's this? Footlocker? There's a lot of footlockers around here. No. Open. No. Um. Oh. Camera for scientist scrubs? Why not? Wait, what, what was that? Ammo box? Small energy cell? Oh, never mind. It's bulk ammo. No one wants bulk ammo. So. Deluxe chemistry set. Stim packs. There we go. Nope. Upstairs, I know uh, 8 has some drugs stashed away. He's kind of addicted to Mentats. So we'll open this. These are their charging stations. Trunk. No. Um, you guys, you guys okay over there? Number five, Willow. Okay, this is uh, Dala's room. Ho Dala makes me holla. Trunk. What do you have? Nothing. Have some teddy bears. Sexy sleepwear. Pre-war hat. And then if we go over, meow. Uh. Don't know. It's one of their, one of theirs. Hello, Klein. I think this is Eight's room. If not, we will not nope. To ask again. Uh, they're gonna ask again. More shit. What's in here? Foot Locker. Another scientist glove. I'll take it. That's, it's it's like a blue glove that goes in your fist because that's where gloves go. Average lock. Damn it! Broke it. There we go. Uh, where's Eight's room? Huh? Eight had a bunch of drugs. Okay. Well, anyway, yeah. Let's go ahead and get out of here. We have things to do and other things to do in addition to the things that we're already going to do. So, let's go to the sink and activate the sink with our intelligence core. Revelation now available in the... Salutations and felicitations, sir. And a most... Yay! I am your electronic valet and... Indubitably, sir. But it is with a great lugubriousness that I must disclose that my programmers installed only the masculine honorific, sir. Moreover, they neglected to enclose a parameter by which said honorific might be omitted altogether. Over my most strenuous of remonstrances, sir. Big words, AI! Regrettably not, sir. All modules in this habitat are synthetic personalities atop a mundane operating system. Aww. Personality Indeed, modules? Sir. Though if sir's aim is to activate them, I lament to inform sir that most have been offline for some years. If sir were to ask my opinion. However, if sir is determined to inflict upon sir's self their dubious services. Ha, he doesn't I like them. Backup personality discs. There we go. Uh, why is that? So I can access their functions without loading the personality hall tapes? Aww. the core operating system Aww. Once the tape is installed, sir may request I switch their dialectic interfaces off and I should... Yeah, he doesn't want to hear them talk because he gets annoyed. Uh, why are there so many personality modules? As I am given to understand, sir, this facility was once the property of a Dr. Mobius. He crafted the personality modules as... Um, never mind, let me ask you something else. What services do you provide? To managing the personality... Uh, I'd like to buy some things. Very good. There we go. 
A new triple. Ooh, 14,000. I should have brought some gold with me. Uh, let's see what we can get rid of. I don't think I have anything... Ooh, very important. I'm pretty sure I got rid of all the stuff that I'm not going to use. Uh, crap. Miscellaneous. Uh, the scope for our gun. I guess we could sell... Uh, that's only 14,000. I'll just keep those paintings. Uh, let's get rid of this stuff. I'm never going to use that. Fission battery. Uh, ooh, I, I, yeah, I brought the upgrades too. Why do I have a large scorch... Lead? Hell no! Leather belt? Get that shit out of here! Mantis foreleg? Gee, why? Why? Why do I have that shit? Pencil? Eh, maybe. Ooh, pre-war money. Can I get rid of all that? There we go. 2889. Uh, turpentine... That should be it. Ammo I'm going to keep. And that's items, so yes. Question mark. There we go. Now let's see what you have for sale. Scientist glove, shovel, sonic emitter, revelation. I already have that. Um, metal helmet, patient gown, aid. What do you have? Nothing. I'll take all those. Do that. Uh, ammo. Bulk. That's all the shit that I gave you, isn't it? Ooh, no, you have a lot of ammo. Ooh. Ooh. Look at all that. And that looks like it. Let's go ahead and... Might I be of uh, equipment repaired. Very, Very good, sir. 14,000. Advanced armor. We'll repair that. Guns we don't really need to worry about. Leather backpack. A four cat. Why not? Um, Noxious Cicada, Patient Gown, oh, fuck that. Uh, boo, 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 boo. Helmet, I haven't even used this helmet. Why not? Uh, just because wig and all the other things we can just repair with our weapon repair kit. So, let's What guns do we have? I don't, if I remember, these guns aren't very good. But we're going to go ahead and try and use them anyway. This... Damage 29, DPS, wow, 203. Let's go ahead and mod this. Uh, Mentat Chow, rate of fire. And then if we look at it now, 429. Holy motherfucker. So which gun do we want to put this on, right? Shotgun, 8 is the hollow rifle, 6 is the rail cannon. Mm, what was number 1 again? I'm not sure. You know, let's do the number 1 just for this. And then the other one was a lair. L A E R rifle. It's basically a laser rifle. They just forgot for, to put the S on it. Can we mod this? Stop the, oh, damn it. Cause I had a laser pistol mod. So, I think that should be good for now. We have everything on. Let's go ahead and get some shit rocking. So, what are we going to do? Data. All my friends. Find the missing modules. Picking uh, picking your brains. X8. Let's go ahead and do this one and find the missing uh, personalities. So, let's exit out. Nope, let's do... There we go. And let's go ahead and repair it, too. Um, is it equipped? Okay, and then aid. And thanks to my 100 repair, it... Pr yep. Once you get repair up, this... it That does take, like, no... No, it's like two repair kits to fix an entire gun instead of like six before. So we have this. Ooh, it has a scope on it. I didn't, I, I never, when I played this, I never actually used the guns. I just stuck with the hollow rifle for like every DLC so I can finally uh, experience these. So let's go ahead and which one's closer? You know, let's go ahead and go to this one. The Y-17 Medical Research Facility, which is over here. Can we run? Oh, yes, good. We can run. Is there a radio playing? Yes, there is. 